my. How's it going, all you guys and girls in the Illumination? Time to jump aboard the Loom Train. It's me, it's me, it's JJ, DJ, J, Double J, the Illuminator here, the sweet one. Also known by almost countless other aliases and nicknames, but we will not get into that right now. Yesterday, you know, I, I can't get over, I mean, I, I realize that times are tough right now, and I don't know about your neck of the woods, but around here, they have closed the restaurants down except for delivery and pickup. You can no longer eat inside of restaurants. It's been that way for weeks now. Uh, but I've noticed some of the smaller restaurants, you know, like the pizza places and uh, and the Chinese restaurants and stuff like that. Uh, I noticed yesterday because I ordered some sandwiches for delivery and I happened to notice in the menu online, because that's how I ordered them, that things looked a little expensive. And then I started to think, is this really what's going on? Because either prices went up because of of prices going up for them to get the stuff. So you know how they pay more for it, so we pay more for it. Or prices went up because they're losing business because no one can eat inside anymore. And if that's the truth, then that's a real rotten thing to do at this, uh, at this junction. Because in my opinion... And and this is you know this is a proven fact actually I mean in my opinion though, uh, the worst thing you can do is raise prices when you're trying to chase profit because that's not how you chase profit. And I've said this before, but I'll say it again. What happens is prices go up so less people order, which makes you raise prices again, and even less people order, and then you're out of business. So the problem here is. If prices went up just because business is down because of the coronavirus, then having us try to make up the difference for you isn't going to work. Because I noticed some places are really expensive compared to what they used to be. I mean, we're not talking about just going up like 50 cents for a sandwich. I'm talking about dollar, dollar fifty. Everything went up. So some places it hasn't. So what's going to happen is I'm going to order from the places that haven't, obviously, like most people would. There's enough places around here that do delivery that I don't have to order from certain places. But really, I hope it's just a natural course of action. But even a few years ago, can you remember those Subway commercials with the $5 foot loans? Around here, a lot of sandwiches were 5 to $6. Now they're over $10 a piece in some places. And it seems like an awful... It seems like an awful thing to do, really, in, in such a short time, to have doubled the price of a sandwich in five years. I mean, really. I don't know. I mean, I hope it's just the natural course of... I hope it's just not because of uh, of, of losing business, but who knows? What do you guys think? I love you all. Take care. Stay safe. This is The Illuminator, and I'll be back. Please, sir, I want some more. Are you talking to me? Are you talking to me?